Hey, my name is Jesse Garcia and I'm involved in the Pastoral Juvene with Baraquel at St. Thomas the Apostle. I was born in Guanajuato, Mexico. I've been living in the U.S. for about 21 years. I've been involved in the Pastoral Juvene since I was about 15. Uh, my brother was the one the, that invited me, so I started to um, join the Pastoral Juvene then. It has greatly impacted my life because it has shown me um, the, our faith, our church, and God in my own understanding. So our group name is Baraquel and it means Bendecidos por Dios. It's a Hebrew name. Bendecidos por Dios means blessed by God. We gather on Fridays afternoons around 7 and uh, there's about 15 of us together every week. That group involves people from 18 to 35 years of age. We start with initial prayer then we do some type of activity. After the activity, we try to cool down and then we start with the theme of the day. Um, it themes vary from depending on the time of year, basically. Um, and then we end up with a final prayer and then we just do the announcements at the end. Most of our talks and prayers are in Spanish. About 90% um, of the young adults that come to Baraquel do speak fully Spanish. They're not bilingual. So it basically, um, it helps them understand what we're trying to get through in their own language and um, makes them feel like home. Right now in La Pastoral Juvenil in Baraquel, there's nine of us leaders that are right now um, leading the young adult group at our parish. Uh, we usually gather around once uh, every two months to try to see what themes or what kind of activities uh, the group will want this, this next um, semester, basically. Our group in Baraquel, we try to go together uh, to Mass as a group. That way we can um, promote the young adult ministry and Pastoral Juvenil in our own community. And so other kids or other young adults like us can, show, can see that um, there's a group just for them. What I love most about La Pastoral Juvenil is that we're all, mm, we're not just friends, we're also family and we're all connected. We're all involved with each other's groups. And also we all try to focus on the struggles that our young adults are going through and the struggles that we're going through. And we try to focus more on the positive aspect of, of Jesus in their lives and try to be a light in their life.